What is ovulation? Hi, my name is Susan and this is The Awesome. Thank you so much for joining me today. So I thought that I should answer this question, what is ovulation, after receiving some questions for, from you guys. So the questions I received were in regards to um, is ovulation the same thing as being pregnant or is ovulation the same thing as getting your period? So I thought that it would be very important for me to make this very quick basic video on what exactly is ovulation. So right off the bat, I can say that ovulation is not being pregnant, ovulation is not getting your period. It is something completely different unto itself. At this point, I suggest um, taking a look at one of my videos that I made quite recently called What is a Menstrual Cycle? And I feel like this will really help you get a better idea of what ovulation is just by knowing what the entire menstrual cycle is. So ovulation is a very short point in time during a menstrual cycle. As I also showed in that last video, here is a diagram of the female reproductive system. So at the very bottom of the image that you're seeing um, would be what you can see from the outside, so uh, the outside of the women's reproductive system. So this is called the vulva. As you move your way up in the diagram, so just inside uh, a woman's reproductive system, then you have what is actually the vagina. So it's just a small like tunnel, which leads you to the cervix. So the cervix sort of opens and closes during our lives, during our menstrual cycles. Um, and the cervix is sort of a doorway, a tunnel sort of doorway that leads into our womb. So above the cervix, you'll see the uterus, also known as the womb. Um, and from there out along the top, two sides are some tubes, which we call the fallopian tubes. And then attached to the very end of those tubes is the ovaries. And also here is another diagram or image of a chart of your menstrual cycles. So this is basically a chart of the different hormones that will be changing their levels throughout your menstrual cycle. So in very basic terms, your menstrual cycle is your body's way of preparing for pregnancy over and over again. It accomplishes this through a ton of different hormonal changes that are happening in your body. It starts the day that you get your period and it ends the day that you get your next period. So from period to period, your, bite, your body is cycling through these changes. Um, the same changes will occur over and over again. And that's why it's called a cycle. Your body is basically cycling through these same hormonal changes continually throughout your reproductive years. So about mid-cycle, ovulation occurs. So there are different parts to your cycles. There's a follicular phase where your follicles, which house the eggs, which hold the eggs, are developing. The follicles are inside of your ovaries. So the follicles are developing. There will be one dominant follicle that will be releasing the egg. Um, so the egg is what you want to get fertilized if you are trying to conceive. If you're not trying to conceive, then obviously you don't want your egg to be fertilized. So after the follicular phase, about mid-cycle, um, during this time when ovulation is going to occur, that is when one dominant follicle that has grown to maturity, um, so all of the other follicles that were starting to develop, they kind of die off and they allow the most dominant one to get to maturity. Um, so that follicle at this time during ovulation, which is about the middle of your cycle, uh, the egg will be released from the follicle within the ovary. And this is called ovulation. This is what ovulation is. So that egg is being released from the follicle that is in the ovary and going, that egg is going into the fallopian tube. This is where we want fertilization to happen. So fertilization is when sperm, a cell which is inside of your partner's semen that he will be ejaculating into you, sperm will be meeting the egg in the fallopian tube during this time if you, if you conceive, um, if the egg gets fertilized. If the egg does not get fertilized at this point, once it is released, 
Your egg will only survive for 12 to 24 hours before it starts to disintegrate. So I hope that has answered your questions about what exactly ovulation is, and I'm sure you have a ton more questions now, if, especially if you're trying to conceive. Um, so one of those questions might be then, so how do you know when exactly you are ovulating? So subscribe to my channel to find out more about that. Also, you're probably wondering, once you find out when you ovulate exactly, when's the best time to have intercourse in order to fertilize the egg? Well, that is a video unto itself as well, which I am creating for you guys. So as I said, please subscribe. The most fertile time might not be exactly when you think it is, especially if you are just learning about ovulation right now. So please subscribe. I love to see you guys here. And if you have any more questions, definitely put them down below. Thank you so much for watching. I will talk to you again very soon. Bye.